greetings my beautiful people welcome or welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here this is sister j a warm welcome to you feel at home enjoy your stay while you're here hit that red subscription button put that post notification bell on so you will be notified of future upload to all my supporters and all my channel members thank you so much for the love and support i really appreciate you Today, I am making pineapple stewed fish. Come along with me, let I show you how I make this delicious meal. My way, my version, and my style. Yeah, real top chef that I fuck. Chop, 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 chop. Chop the potato, chop the carrot. One leap of spice of... So I'm going to be washing my fish with some lemon juice and some vinegar. You can just use vinegar by itself or you can just use lemon or lime juice by itself. But today I'm using both. After washing the fish and get them dry, I'm going to go right into seasoning them. So here I'm mixing some seasoning. So here I have all purpose seasoning, black pepper, garlic powder and Old Bay fish seasoning or seafood seasoning. So I'm just going to mix that up and then we start the process. Here I have my fish, they're already dry and it's time to season them up. You can always add some oil to the fish so the seasoning can stick on better. Or if you choose to just have them dry like that, it's okay. Because we're frying them. So. so I'm just trying to put the seasoning in between those slices that I make on the fish. So it can be well marinated. If you're here for the first time and you're not yet connected with me, go ahead and hit that red subscription button, put that post notification bell on, so you will be notified of future upload. Right here in Sister J's Kitchen, I do simple and easy Caribbean recipes. And if you're here and you're not yet connected with my other channel, Sister J's World, please slide over and do the do. Over in Sister J's world is where I do all my natural juices and smoothies and all the vlogs. So please go check out Sister J's world, subscribe, like and share. Thank you so much. I will put a full list of the ingredients that I'm using on this fish right here on the left. Here I have the pot and I'm adding some oil to that. So we can start to fry some fish. I'm adding garlic, onion, and thyme to the oil. So all these seasoning can be infused in the fish, yes. I have to cut this one in two because it was too big for the pot. And now I'm just going to add another fish to the corner there. Here I'm beating up some pimento. You can always use a pimento oil if you choose or you can just beat it up sometime i beat them up sometime i don't so or you can just crush them if you don't want to say beat your crush okay so now i'm turning my fish golden brown 
as you can see so now I'm going to remove these fish from the pot and then I'll add the next set because these are well done guys When it comes to stew fish, you use the fish of your choice. So that's the first set that I fried was snapper. And these are called pompino. Yes, in different countries, they might call them different name. But this is what it's called here, pompino. And them taste good. <laughs> I try them and I like them. So, yeah. So I'm just going to um, remove this set and then we're going to make some sauce for the fish. Yes, here I have the onion, pimento, scallion, bell pepper. And right here I have garlic and thyme. And this is the star of the show, the pineapple. I'm adding some garlic to the pot and I'm adding the onion, at least some of the onions. Now I'm adding the carrots. Then the star of the show, the pineapple. Now I'm adding some pineapple juice. One tablespoon of honey. You can also use sugar. All purpose seasoning. A tablespoon of ketchup. Mix it in. Now I'm adding black pepper. A generous amount of garlic powder. And now I just add the pimento in. And now I'm adding the bell pepper, the thyme, the scallion, and some more onion. And look at the colorful pot. And we just add in our fish to this sauce. And guys, this smell so, so good. Now I'm adding a hot pepper and I'm just going to cover this down and let it simmer down. Yes, guys. And I'll be serving this with some gungo rice and peas along with tomato and cucumber. And you know, when it comes to stew fish, you can serve it with the staple of your choice. It go good with anything. Mm -hmm. It go good with anything. Since, since the pineapple in there, you can just eat it just like that. A pineapple can be this staple. Yes. I thank you so much for watching. Please remember to like, share, and comment. If you haven't yet subscribed, what are you waiting on? Just go ahead, man. Do the do. Hit that red subscription button. Okay? Take care of yourself and loved ones. Be safe. Live good, work good, pray good. Subscribe for more.
Thanks for watching. Yeah, man. Bless up yourself.